The Court of Owls is watching. From inside of Gotham's walls. They lurk in every shadow. And they rule you. One and all. You knew. All along you knew and you never told Bruce about the threat to Gotham. When I was still part of the League, we observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They're mining something. Something that seems like it might come from a Lazarus pit. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. Guess we know how the Talons are cooked up, then. Thanks for that. But... Why leave the court digging? Why not offer them a Lazarus pit? Then control them from the inside. Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the Court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus Pits. You don't treat the Lazarus Pits any different than the Court. Oh, those are some harsh words. After all, your friend Jason benefited. What about what he wanted? Jason had no say in what you did to him. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. You don't get to talk about gratitude right now, Talia. With Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. I know you, Talia. You just want us to get rid of the voice so you can do whatever you want. What's your endgame here? I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. Oh, this is how Montoya feels. Hey, Alfred, did the city records turn up anything? They didn't. According to the city permits, there's been no mining in Gotham City since the cauldron was completed. Judging from what we found last night, they've been digging down there for centuries. Hmm. Hmm. Give this a listen, Alfred. Babs managed to repair some of the court voice recordings. Dionysium brought the Talons back to life. Sort of. Dionysium's basically weak as hell Lazarus pit water. Brings back motor functions. But free will's as good as gone. So what is a Talon exactly? Some kind of feral zombie assassin? We've all seen weirder shit. Maybe. Feral zombie? 
Sounds like Jason, all right. I recognize a voice. The older woman is Constance Cobblepot, I'm fairly certain. And the others? More difficult to say. Maybe if I heard them in person. In person? Tim, put the waveforms on the screen. It's hard to find a match with all the damage and voice modulation. Maybe the matching system would have better luck if- We match what we have against the live voices. Fun, but how do we find these jackasses? Two words, Orchard Hotel. The Masquerade, the event of the season. This year's dedicated to Master Bruce. Gotham's rich dress up and pretend they're humanitarians. I've been a few times. So it's Dirtbag Central. With so many of Gotham's elite together, security at the Masquerade will be tight. Finding out their plans first would give you an important advantage. I'll tweak our masks to record telescopic audio. If we can get a good vantage point, we may be able to put some faces to these mystery voices. Sounds like our kind of party. There's new info on the board. I leveraged a mutual acquaintance. The head of security for the Orchard Hotel. Physical and mental preparation go hand in hand. Here, we can train the mind to prepare the body, but it requires deep focus. Let go of your self-doubt and focus on my voice. Hmm. <laughs> 
I expect no less. I'm proud of you, Dick. Don't forget that you have a rendezvous with Mr. Hendricks. Thanks for the heads up, Belfry.
keep my 5k personal best, but forget it. Damn. Looks like the court grabbed Hendrix. We've had reports of gang activity. With luck, that's Hendrix. We need officers near the Gotham Naval Research Facility. Seems like I found the party. Some good cardio in today. I had a feeling this day was coming. You wouldn't believe the things that I heard at the hotel. Probably why the court wanted you silenced. Shit, they're real? That explains the masks. Look, one of my guys was feeding them info. And you know what? You should probably have all the same intel, too. Thanks for the drive. We'll take care of it from here. This city is going to the birds, I swear. Belfry, I dealt with the court. Got a data drive for the trouble. Excellent. Please return to the Belfry so we can evaluate next steps. Dispatch, we're going to be at the scene soon. It's probably time I left.
Citizen to work day. Send an ambulance. Someone's injured. I've contacted Dr. Tompkins. She's sending paramedics. these things is not like the other. Absolutely nothing. Still enjoying a life of crime. Uh, well, 
Maybe it's time for me to go. I didn't know it was take a citizen to work day. There we go. Belfry, have we had any reports of freaks bringing citizens into their crimes for, you know, fun? You're kidding, right? Let's just say hypothetically. No reports of any freaks trying that. But if you do see it happening again, check it out and report back. Jumping in shadows here. So this is still happening. What's going on with her? How about a nap? You keep this up, I'm gonna fall asleep. Nothing to stress about. Go on, give me a reason to hurt you. Get on with it. Uh, well, maybe it's time for me to go. Got Nightwing! Someone help me! Thank you! What have we got here? Don't live your life. Requeue it.
Activity reported. Officers advised to use caution. Look at it, you sniper! Out like a light. I was hoping to talk to her. There's gotta be something on here that'll tell me what's happening. About time you showed up. Nightwing at your service. And you are? If I don't need to know your real name, you don't need to know mine. I got grandkids to think about. You can just call me Madame Palomares. Nice to meet you, Madame Palomares. Your message said you had some information. I do. What I'm about to tell you is highly confidential. There's a group of us. People who want to see real change in Gotham. We call ourselves... The Watch. Good name. What do you watch? I started the group years ago when I got fed up with all the bad apples in this town. Yeah. Gotham's got a whole orchard. I reached out to Batman for help. He wasn't too sure about us at first. But I showed him that having eyes on the ground could be useful. So we started giving him tips to help him keep our neighborhood safe. He told me that if he ever went quiet for this long, that I should reach out to you. So you're the eyes and ears out here. We can work with that. Especially if Batman vouched for you. I'll spread the word to the other members of the Watch. He is missed. But the entire Watch has your back. We can do this. Together.
Nothing new to report. Till next time. Don't worry, the coast is clear. So, where's Batman? He owes me a coffee. I'm afraid you're stuck with me now. Well, damn. Sorry. He really helped Mum and I out a lot. How is Leslie? It's been forever. She's fine, enjoying retirement, watches medical dramas to nitpick them. But there's still a shit ton of work to do here, for both of us. This city does not like to let you sleep. You've been helping people in Gotham, and that's great. So keep it up. Come visit me once in a while, and I'll pass on anything helpful I might find. Besides, Mum will send both of us to the ER if I don't keep an eye on your health. Then I won't be a stranger. Doctor's orders. I've uploaded the data we got from Hendrix. It should be ready soon. I've seen Bruce make that same face when he got stuck on a case. What's on your mind? Everything starts with Ra's al Ghul attacking Batman, but I, I can't figure out how it connects. You've never had to fight the League, have you?
Raish is... was a fanatic. He formed the League of Shadows centuries ago to root out corruption all over the world. His philosophy, if you want to call it that, is that he should destroy things to build them back up. He's wiped out multiple cities over the centuries. He set his sights on Gotham. Batman stopped him. He was impressed. So he named Bruce his heir. That suddenly, even though Bruce said no thanks. But it meant Raish left Gotham alone. And that is until he showed up and... Bruce. Talia says Raish was behaving erratically when he died. Yeah. I put money on that not being the whole story. Hang on. What if our starting point is earlier? Batman died while he was investigating the Court of Owls. You think Raish found out about it? But why come after his heir? Raish cares about two things. Rooting out corruption and protecting the Lazarus Pits. So if the court was using an extract from the pits to create talents... Raish blows a gasket, steps in himself. Things escalate, both he and Bruce end up dead. And without Batman keeping a lid on Gotham's corruption, the court starts to stretch its wings. The League follows Raish to Gotham, and there's nobody to stop them from attacking the court. Gotham City becomes ground zero for a goddamn war. And no Batman to save it. I guess that's our job now. Yeah. It is. And we know what we need to do. We root out the court. And we keep the League away from Gotham. I really miss him. Excellent. The drive Mr. Hendricks provided us contains exactly what we need. I've set up a safe house for Mr. Hendricks. His original one was compromised, but he'll be all right now. Glad to hear it.
Any luck looking into those weird pills or the doctor's website? The website for the mysterious Dr. Q seems to have vanished, but we'll keep looking. We have to think this is Harley, but what is she up to? Is that not always the question with Dr. Quinzel? Ah, uh, let us know if you find anything. Of course. Guys, come check this out. Dick, it's upside down. I got it. Hmm. Harley's an actual shrink. Why is she selling healing bracelets, supplements? <sighs> what the hell's a free glow egg? Mm-mm. Huh. Who would even buy that crap? She knows the stuff doesn't work. So what's her angle? Most Gothamites will see her be involved in one or more violent crimes a month. You know, statistically speaking. What's that got to do with anything? She's selling them hope. Oh, crap. Come to the Monarch Theater tonight. I've got an explosive announcement just for you. She definitely means explosive, literally. Well, Batman would have hated that. Are you getting this, Belfry? Indeed, sir. It seems Dr. Quinzel has made a spectacle of the event. Crap. Whatever Harley has waiting for us in there isn't going to be pretty. I was Harley Quinn. Now I'm Dr. Q, the best version of me. Recover your power. Uh, it's cheating how them regulator mopes do things. Don't huh? You think? What's that? Oh, uh... Sweet dreams. Freaks seem to have the theater locked down. There might be an old entrance, I remember. Doubtful the freaks know of it. Belfry, are you telling me you have a dark seedy past I'm not aware of? Old actors never tell trade secrets, sir. Is it?
Alfred. The old actor really does have his secrets. I hate to see the monarch in such bad shape. Ha! I remember that. That man did not like it. Belfry, wasn't there some sort of theft at Daggett Labs? Yeah, there was a break-in last week. Looks like Harley was responsible. Daggett makes some heavy-duty medicine. Nothing I'd want in her hands. Daggett crates here. No sign of any bombs, though. Call if you find anything. Harley brought plenty of company. We let our fears run us. Let our fears be the basis of us. Well, I say, screw that. Yes! Choose to be different. Choose to make choices. Choose to wreck your life. Yeah, be close now. Grab him! He's fucking out there!
there's so many mannequins. Get up. Q you have in you. Ah. Oh look, a hero coming to stop me from helping you. What do we say? Boom! Don't worry. That's why I made this. This little thing will give you the courage to do what you always wanted to do. An implant that lets you take on the world! Gotham, come on! This is Harley Quinn! Whatever's in that is bad for you! Ugh. I bet you want to see it in action! Oh, hey there, big guy. Belfry, does our data tell us what these chips actually do? They don't seem to be implanted with anything. Still hardly a level playing field here. Your word moves! Who's with me? Screw the heroes, right? Right, move! Nice to see you they too. Destroyed your lives. But we have to help ourselves. That is why I gave Holy all perfect my attack, Nightwing. Those implants. That will make them strong. Let's 
something for you? Dr. Q has an extra strength model. Ahem. Why don't we try this again? <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh good, there's more. Come on. Bet we don't have to do all of this. down if I were you. Definitely hurt you more than me. 
Looks like your product didn't work. <laughs> it helped us get you where you need to be. Isn't that right, Quinners? Free. I think I found the bombs. Echo protocol is a go. Fire has been detected. Please leave in an orderly fashion. Belfry, is there any way to remotely stop these bombs? They appear to be on a closed circuit, sir. You'll have to disarm them manually. Thank you. 
from my friendly associates on your way out. Zekta Q has left the building. If you see in this video, it means we're all alive. A bit boring, really. <laughs> oh, don't worry, it ain't all bad. I got one last little surprise for you. She gave me an F for glued ability? And that's a helpful note to do more squats? <sighs> Excellent. The drive Mr. Hendricks provided us contains exactly what we need. 
The voice of the court's modulator is gonna be a pain to remove. I'll pull up some of Bruce's old files, see how he disguised his voice back in the day.